Let's go into weather. Kamaka Pili. As we step into the new week, our threats looking to be good for the most part before they slightly get worse as we get into the middle of the week. The only thing slightly elevated is our ocean conditions. Our high tide is running about a half a foot higher than normal right now. And with that, in uh, combination with high ocean conditions and levels in general, we are expected to have some flooding around the islands from today, within tomorrow, possibly with the next day, but it's starting to come down. So just be aware of that. Now, in terms of our winds, we are having more of an east shift after a day of variable winds and that has to do with the cold front that's passing north of the islands. Right now we have most high clouds towards the east of the state but that's starting to lift further north clearing up those high clouds to get more uh, blue skies coming through. That will continue to bring some instability for tomorrow towards the west end of the state as that upper level disturbance is really situated just southwest of Oahu right now. So what we can expect for tomorrow is some passing showers for the windward and Malka sections mainly for the west end of the state. But as we get into the middle of the week into the second half this cold front will be playing the next weather maker in terms of the shower activity that cold front again is what brought the light and variable winds last night into today that moisture will finally be brushed down towards the islands we're looking starting to come Tuesday Wednesday hopefully start to clear up by Thursday but we have another cold front that will be passing north of the islands that moisture will then just bring another round of wet weather possibly at the ending of the week so this whole extended forecast you can expect a wetter than normal trade wind pattern pattern. What we're expecting for tomorrow though again a little more stable conditions as a lot of that moisture starts to clear up but the instability remains because of that upper level disturbance. We're looking at seven o'clock tomorrow morning. As you can see most of the moisture will be leaning towards Kauai as we progress through the day and then as we get into Tuesday we definitely see that boundary coming in of that cold front that will be bringing uh, widespread shower activity in the middle of the week. But for tomorrow you can expect partly cloudy skies with those winds remaining light to moderate around 10 to 15 miles per hour across the islands. In terms of our ocean conditions, 3 to 5 up north, 2 to 4 for the west, and 1 to 3 down on the south and east facing shores. Now the good news, trade winds are back. They're going to remain light for the uh, days to come. Another round of wet weather again for the middle of the week from that first cold front. We have that second cold front that can continue that shower activity into the weekend, but the good news, winds are expected to get windy. Sam, I'll give it back to you.